objective of the campaign is to get the company to agree to a shutdown date because this particular coal-fired plant is the last one in New England that does not have a shutdown date. My name is Adam Rice. I'm from South Portland, Maine. And we are very resolved to not stop until we get that shutdown date. Um, because it, it's, it's 2020 now, we should not be burning coal, and coal is the dirtiest fuel, and all ratepayers in New England are currently subsidizing this plant with about $50 million a year. In Massachusetts, Vermont, New Hampshire, Maine, and Rhode Island, but in the course of the whole campaign, we've also had people from Delaware, Pennsylvania, New York. We all got trespassing notices, so we can't protest on the property anymore. We have since uh, used our nonviolent, peaceful, civil disobedience tactics to delay trains entering the station. So we did one blockade a couple weeks ago in three states, and that lasted about two days. Uh, we've done a couple more since then. Uh, the most recent one I was at was in Worcester, where the train did not stop. Um, nobody was hurt, nobody was arrested at that one. Uh, this last one, we set up scaffolding on the tracks uh, in hopes to hold the train long enough that the ISO in Holyoke, Mass. would come out and actually negotiate with us. Four people were arrested and will have to go back for trial. 34 people participated in the action. You know, we wore tons and tons of warm clothes and we carried uh, the structure through the woods for uh, half a mile down the track, so it was right in the middle of the woods. but. The structure was 16 feet, built um, precisely to be uh, reassembled. The pieces, we carried oh. the pieces, reassembled on the tracks so that um, people could dig in and stay there and refuse to be removed. And they were you know, pretty high up in the air and they had their sleeping bags. And they were very careful, they were very concerned about safety. How many it cars? It was three quarters of a mile. It ca had like, huge. It was huge. Lots, and I lots. think it had. It was. I think it was fifty thousand tons of coal, three quarters of a mile long. It travels at a speed of seven miles per hour. So you know, but they were given notice. And in addition to that call, we had people in our group that were flaggers that were further you know, between us and the train. The, Where train, was the train stopped, stopped for seven hours and took the four people who were on the structure off to be jailed. And, and as New Englanders, we can do our part and just keep pushing to shut down Bo and contribute to the bigger movement to just end the fossil fuel use and transition to renewable energy.